Hello and welcome back to the series on JavaScript for testers. I'm Bushra Alam and in this video we'll enter the fascinating world of JavaScript. So, what is JavaScript? Well, let's start by boasting one of the most popular misconceptions about JavaScript. JavaScript is not Java. Comparing JavaScript to Java is like comparing apples to oranges. Both are fruits, but what else is similar? Mm, nothing. Similarly, both JavaScript and Java are programming languages, but they are meant for different things. JavaScript is in no way related to Java. Okay, so with that out of our way, let's now see what JavaScript actually is. JavaScript was initially created to make web pages alive. That means things like displaying timely content updates, interactive maps, animated 2D, 3D graphics, and so on. Back then, it was capable of running in a web browser. Web browsers have JavaScript engine to execute JavaScript code. For instance, ICE JavaScript engine is called Chakra. Firefox JavaScript engine is called SpiderMonkey. And Chrome's JavaScript engine is called V8. So, up until this point, you could only run JavaScript inside a browser because only browsers had JavaScript engines. Then came Node.js, also called Node. Node enables us to run JavaScript code on our machine instead of relying on a browser. So Node is a JavaScript runtime environment that executes JavaScript code outside of a browser. Node.js is built on top of Chrome's open source V8 JavaScript engine. So now, JavaScript could be used as front-end, client-side, as well as back-end or the server-side language. Now let's have a look at some of the features of JavaScript. JavaScript is client-side as well as server-side language, as we have just discussed. And because JavaScript can be used on both client as well as the server-side, it has been referred to as lingua franca of the web. Lingua franca means a language that is adopted as a common language between speakers whose native languages are different. JavaScript is lightweight interpreted programming language. Interpreted means that the code is run from top to bottom and the result of the running code is immediately returned. You don't have to transform the code into a different form before the browser runs it. JavaScript is dynamically typed, like most other scripting languages. Dynamically typed means, say you have a variable which initially holds a number. You may, at later point, make the variable hold a string instead. Functions as first class objects. Functions in JavaScript are objects. They have properties and methods, just like any other object. Functions can be passed as arguments in other functions. They can also be thrown as exceptions. I hope you got the feel of what JavaScript is. See you on the next video where we'll install and set up Node and a code editor.